Swamp's over here, and I'm going to let you in on a little secret. That's dumb. It's not a secret. It's a review of the Elite Force 1911. It is safe to say that the Elite Force 1911 is one of the best airsoft pistol platforms that has ever been created. I'm Christopher Ratton, owner of Balahack Airsoft, and I'm proud to say that the Elite Force 1911 has truly been battle tested in the swamps of Balahack. The Elite Force 1911 comes in two different models. You have the two-tone tactical version, and then you have the standard version. These are both full metal CO2 blowback airsoft pistols. This pistol is by far my favorite pistol in the entire world. These pistols come with one standard 14 round magazine, giving you the option of 14 plus one in the chamber. It comes with a handy dandy Allen key already with it. It takes 12 gram CO2 cartridges, and one of those I have found should last you four to five full magazines. To load the CO2, you simply unscrew a screw at the base of the magazine, insert front end first, screw it in until you hear a nice little tss. These magazines are very easy to load. And then you are good to go. The tactical version has a front rail system on it, so you can apply a flashlight, and both have a negative 14 millimeter thread so that you can add a sweet sound. The tactical version has an upper ambidextrous safety, whereas the standard version has a safety on the left side, and both have a handle safety as an NE1911. This pistol is absolutely perfect for Balahack because at our field, you have a lot of swamps and woods that immediately turn into mouth in close quarter style fighting. Excellent conditions to have a good secondary weapon. With point twos, we found that they have chronoed between 325 and 340, mainly settling at around 330. With two fives, which we strongly recommend because this gun can more than handle them, it hovers just over 300. This puts you at an excellent FPS for most fields and especially most CQB situations. These guns perform amazingly, even when they are wet, when they're in harsh conditions, or if they're in freezing conditions. It will keep going for you. It proves itself on par with most AEGs out there in terms of range, accuracy, and consistency. And this thing is a beast. If you are looking for a reliable pistol that packs a punch, you need not look any further than the Elite Force 1911. It only made sense to us that the Elite Force 1911 would be the first battle tested in the Swamps of Balahack gun that we provide online. We know it's going to work for you. We know you're going to love it. It is all around an awesome gun. Those of you who already own one know what I'm talking about. Those of you who don't, you're missing it. Skirt! So as a sniper, primarily, you need to have a reliable sidearm. Um, I still have mine, uh, my Elite Force 1911 from forever ago. Still got my Lucky Beeble. Beeble. I'm going to restart that. Skirt! So, as a sniper, primarily, I need to have a reliable sidearm, especially when I'm using one that has an MED, minimum engagement distance, on it. So, I still have my uh, Leap Force 1911, still got my Lucky BB uh, right there, and the hammer, which is pretty cool. And it still works. It's, it's absolutely amazing. But, I couldn't mention this gun without mentioning my... Uh, that gun will always be my first love, but I have kind of like a new affair, kind of a fling, if you will. As many of you know, the uh, CZ-75 SP-01 Shadow made by ASG, both of these guns are incredibly good. This gun uh, matches my real steel gun, as you can see here. Uh, this gun just does not have much recoil. It's amazing how fast you can return on target. The weight is a little different unless you keep a magazine in, in the uh, ASG one. And I lost this in the swamp 
like this. Christopher, we gotta go. Yeah, I know. Covering. Go. Now you see it. <laughs> now you don't. And then I found it like this. I've had enough. It is now Saturday, December 17th, one month and four days after I lost my pistol. I am finally determined to find this thing. I am going to find my lost pistol. I rewatched the video. I think I see where it fell. I don't care how wet I have to get. Come on, baby. This is the Sistema Metal Detector version 8. Should have fallen. <gasps> no, what is that? Please. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Over a month later, which was crazy, and it still works like this. Too. So I could have just cleaned this thing um, immediately after I got it out of the swamp, but I think the water protected it a lot. I mean, obviously it's incredibly well built, but the water protected it because it wasn't exposed to oxygen. So I decided to not clean it uh, for the last few weeks since I found it, leave it exactly, exactly how it was so that it had every chance to, to rust. Um, or to be faulty. Uh, and now I'm gonna see if it actually shoots. We shall see. Oh my gosh. Literally, in the swamp for over four weeks, uh, and then just exposed to air, not cleaned at all, didn't touch the internals, didn't take it apart or anything. The uh, <laughs> ASG CZ, 75 SPO1 shadow right there shooting perfectly the hop up's not even affected now there you go it should lock back because there's no rounds in it oh nope I just ran out of air now that's a test that is a test on the gun cover it with water and mud don't do this obviously but <laughs> That's, that's freaking awesome. So if you wanna buy either of these guns uh, or new variants uh, of the 1911, we have all of that on BalahackAirsoft.com. Each gun has free shipping on it. We've got extra magazines and all that. So go to BalahackAirsoft.com or just support your local airsoft store or field if they offer them there. Thank you guys so much for watching um, and just hope that helps some. Uh, make sure you have a reliable pistol on you uh, and that's it. So, Swamp Stepper out. Mm -hmm.